So make sure your seats are in the upright and locked position and your seat belts buckled because it's going to be a wild ride, folks. Family meeting. Come here. Come. Close enough. I get the head. That's the cute part. Right. Joy, <laughs> is that you? Don't poop in her face. She likes smelling smelly things. Well, she burps in our face all the she time, does. actually. How do you like it now? <laughs> How do you smell good? I'm trying it's to so clean. move it a little more so you can. Hippo stand. No, she's not in it. <laughs> it's a family meeting. Come on, Harlow, make an effort. Over here. There we go. Okay. <laughs> If your mother's making me do it, I <laughs> yeah. do it. I'm not making anyone do anything. Oh, you're not? All right, Harlow, let's God, go. Wait. <laughs> we gotta update them. <laughs> so cute, though. Yeah. All right, Hippo, do you know what's... Oh, she does smell good. Mm -hmm. Do you, do you know what's good? happening? No, not that good. <laughs> not as good as Harlow. <laughs> okay, Hippo, do you know what's happening? Something really <laughs> exciting. I know we all have been waiting and waiting for an update video on our house, but we've until this point had nothing to say because all we had nothing. was April, 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 April. Finally, we have dates and progress 17th. to share with y'all. The, the 17th, we have our next walkthrough and yes. that's where we go with the builders and the agent and our realtor and we give them something called a punch list because at that point, our house is completely done. And so with the punch list, we tell them little things they need to fix. Like if there's chipped paint or a scuff for something on the floor or, um, broken window, right? Yep, the one broken window that's on there. Our last <laughs> our last walkthrough with the builder, one of the windows happened to be broken and he was like, oh, that's it's not It's $150 off the house. <laughs> and John's like, let's break all the windows. Let's no, chip away at it, $150 at a time. <laughs> no, so we just have to make sure everything's in tip top order. Thankfully, our awesome realtor, Mark, is going with us and he's very experienced in making these punch lists. Um, Cause we, we have, are, we feel so nice. We are like, first we, time home buyers. Yeah. We have no idea about anything. Having a good realtor on our side has been awesome. We know about dogs, specifically this one. We know about Disney. Specifically Disney. But <laughs> buying a house was very new to us, but I feel like we've gotten a lot of support and guidance from the right sources in yep. this journey. But anyways, then after we do the punch list on the 17th, they're going to give us an estimated closing date based on what needs to be done. Maybe nothing needs to be done. That would be awesome. And generally the closing date will be the following week. So then the week after Easter is when we should have our final walkthrough and closing and moving. So it's happening. We were kind of estimating yes, mid-April. It seems like it's going to be towards the end of April, but April nonetheless. We're excited. And yeah, Judd said she's getting a yard. A lot of y'all have asked about the fence. Like, are we going to fence it so in? So we're not going to fence it in at first. Okay. Not right here's, away. here's why. So well, driving through the neighborhood, a lot of our neighbors got their houses finished in the winter time. And Florida, we have a very dry winter. In, oh, it's been oh, it's been a hit and mix this year. But usually we have a dry winter, and a lot of the yards didn't take. Meaning they died. So, especially with fresh sod, before you want to fence it in, which is going to shade half a yard, I would like it, it to. Our homeowner says we have to get a six foot privacy fence, yeah, which is what we want it's anyway. Tall, it's tall as me. But it's going to so, put a lot of shade on our especially yard. in our side yards. So I would, we're going to wait until the sod takes root and after at least the first couple mows. And it's healthy because yeah. we don't want to put up the fence. I mean, yes, it'd be nice for her to have a fenced in yard, which she will have eventually, but we want, you know, the yard. That's going to be like take. maybe a month or two. Yeah. So, so we're coming into summer we're getting a lot more rain. And it should take well, especially lot, lot if we make sure it has all the sunlight, not blocking it with the fence. So also hippo feet to aerate it. A lot of you are very excited to see how we decorate and design like the interior of our house. And we're excited for that too. But keep in mind that buying and moving and all that is expensive in itself. And what do you keep saying? We have the rest of our life to decorate this thing. So it's going to be a slow going progress. I have so many ideas. I can't wait to like really make it our own and it's going to look great, Oops. but it's going to be a slow process, uh, which of course I'll update y'all on. I do have a playlist for our how like our whole home buying journey here. And if I do anything like decor wise or whatever, I'll add to that playlist, make videos for y'all, but just know it's not going to like instantly be this dream 
back with home. It's gonna be which would be nice. Now, that, that'd be great if that happened, but, but it's gonna be slow. Snap going. our fingers and everything's moved from here to there, and all the walls are painted. What we and want, everything's and everything's done. But no, so. it'll be a slow going process, but that's fine because we're gonna have our house and mm. you know, we have the furniture we need to furnish like half of it at least. We have furniture for a living room, half a, a living dining room, room. that's bigger than this. We, oh, we a did bedroom? buy a really nice <laughs> dining room table. A Winterfell dining room table. So we're excited about that. So we were like, yeah, we'll get the dining room table now. It's really nice. Um, but yeah, we need two more bedrooms furnished, half the living room more chairs for the dining room but so people can come stay with us but they can sleep on the floor <laughs> or that's all we got air mattresses <laughs> yeah. it'll be uh, also fine. uh amazon wish list purchase yes thing. If thank you, you for guys purchased. for doing things i'm blown away yes so a lot of people asked us to make a housewarming wish list and so after a lot of thought we did we were really reluctant on doing it but we got asked so many times yes and it's not I've the first been... time we've been asked for amazon wish list or anything yeah so and we always do stuff to cater towards you guys if exactly. you know, whatever you guys ask for we do it so, so we made the list and i'm very blown away at the the response to it like thank you mm -hmm. it, it, it i mean it does help like please don't feel you have to go even look at the list. Nope. If you just want to watch videos, that's fine. Like the list was originally created for Judd and I to be like, okay, this is what we need for a house and we're slowly going to get to buying everything. But with y'all helping, like, just thank you. But yes. also if you just want to watch videos, we love you all the same. Like, please don't feel pressured. Um, nope, not at all. But for those who have bought something, of course you've been curious about when we're going to start the live streams and opening the gifts and reading the notes in them, which we're excited for. So the first week Hello. in May, I work in Orlando. Mm -hmm. And that's where we're storing them in his mom's <coughs> house just because we don't have any storage here. We have no place to put the packages and then we're already going to have to move. Like we just don't want to add to yeah. it. So first week in May, uh, when I get back from Orlando, all the packages are going to be with me, including the ones this one already live yeah, streamed. I was about own. to say, <laughs> Carlo one. had an early start to opening <laughs> the packages. I still feel bad about it, but thankfully everyone whose package was opened by her found it comical. Like, Harlow, you must have just really liked Unlike my us. gift. But, I uh, was mortified. I was like, this is so rude of... Anyway, if you want to watch that video, it's like right here. Or over there. Or there. No, no, no. Or one of it's in, I always used to mix it up. It's, it's in this one corner. of these four corners. Anyways. <laughs> so, yeah, we're moving probably the week after thanks, um, Thanksgiving. Oh, the week after Jesus Easter, <laughs> which is like the last or second to last week of April. And then the first weekend in May, he works in Orlando. He'll bring all the packages back and, and then that's, that's shortly we'll after we'll start the live streams and I don't know it's exciting stuff that's exciting stuff so it's yes exciting month we updated y'all game of thrones is coming in this month oh yeah God. we're moving this month we are easter is this month hippo's I'm birthday is on the 28th this month. of june which yeah. is not this month but it's getting close hippo we always like to celebrate your birthday. We do. Uh, we like More to celebrate than our her than our own. <laughs> our anniversary is June 12th, and we always tend to go bigger for our last birthday. We do. So. <laughs> we love you. Your little tail. <laughs> I love when her tail wags like that. It's like, boop, 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 boop. It's so cute. <laughs> so that's what we had to update y'all on. I'm sure you're excited about it, just as we are, and we want to thank you for coming along on all these mm -hmm. journeys and big. This is, I mean, this is a big life step for us. So make sure your seats are in the upright and locked position and your seat belts buckle because it's going to be a wild ride, folks. <laughs> I was like, what? Harlow's like, I don't know what you're doing, but as long as you're rubbing me, it's fine. We love you, Hippo. Anyways, stay tuned, y'all. And with that, we will say goodbye. And thanks for joining us on our adventure.